Okay, and as I was talking about the water system uh, on the ground with the hose in the middle of the plastic mat running down, uh, the, the best way to water is on the ground. Uh, you know, you really don't want to water on top of the plants overhead. Uh, you don't want to have water splashing from the dirt to the plant. You want to avoid all that. Uh, so what we're trying to do here is keeping the water on the ground, no splash or minimum splash and running along the bottom uh, and it can be taken out of a pond as I mentioned but it be, could be as well taken out of your well or any other way that you can get water. And you've had this for 10 years and you don't have problems with disease? Be is that partly because of this? Uh, yes, I, it's all the things that we talked about. Not having the splash, not watering from above, keeping good soil nutrition. Again, uh, I'm a natural farmer, so I have to find natural ingredients to add uh, to what the, what the plants need from the soil. If I'm coming up short on calcium, I, I've been using wood ash and chicken manure with high nitrogen. It seems to have worked the best. And uh, so do you water the tops of the plants in ever? Or? Well, I have sprayed them a little bit and tried foliar feeding, different things, you know, even pond water once in a while, I'll spray them and see what the effect is. Uh, I think I was mentioning to you, Eric, earlier, everything's an experiment. You know, I've been doing this, as you probably can see, for a long time. But every year you're doing more and more experimentation than you are anything else. So we always try new things.